Okay folks, here it's TJ Fisherman with another video. I'm going to do a video today of my workshop. Those are the batteries for my boat. I keep them inside over the winter time. Um, we'll start off with my fly tying supplies. I got three drawers there. And three drawers there full of fly tying supplies. I do it all. I build a lot of my own stuff. I'm hoping to get into custom painting my own crankbait soon. I paint my own jig heads, build my own crawler harnesses, tie my own flies. I've recently got into fly fishing a couple years ago, so I tie my own flies. And my tool caddy here for all my fly tying tools more fly tying supplies here I have a coon tail pheasant wings and a full pheasant cape all for fly tying I have another cool little project that I'm working on here this is a, like a shadow box I just have a bunch of old fishing lures in it I'm gonna wait until it's full to to display it I have a lure testing tank that has a filter in it and uh, I have a little pond pump there to make a current to see how well the, the lures will swim and then after I'm done testing them I have a drying rack here where they hang dry And we'll go on to my fishing rod collection here. These are the fishing rods that I use on a more regular basis. Then we have my inflatable pontoon boat. And then we get into my fishing lures. There's the four tackle boxes that don't exactly fit in my tackle box anymore this is soft plastics this is soft plastics and the very top bag here is soft plastics this is all um, fishing rigs cat fishing rigs trout fishing rigs slip rigs and stuff that I've tied myself and then this is my tackle box that is <clears throat> that is completely full then I have more lure building supplies here I have miscellaneous blades and stuff for crawler harnesses and spinners I have a kit here full of jig skirts and trailers and spinner bait trailers I have Plastic bags for keeping all my stuff organized after I make something I mark it and put it in a plastic bag um, I have beads and things in this drawer for Building whatever I want pretty much I can do almost anything um, The bottom two drawers here are full of extra Fly tying materials different foams and stuff that don't fit in my other box over there and then you have my waders, my daughter's waders, my daughter's vest, and my fishing vest here. <clears throat> and I believe that's about it for back here. Now we'll walk over here and I'll show you my fly rods. Yes, I know this is a gun cabinet, but it holds my fly rods very well. I have, uh, well, all of those but one are mine. Uh, one of them is my daughter's. And then down here, I have all my flies that I've tied up here on the top. And then down on the bottom is my... Uh, 
fly pack that I use for fly fishing. And that'll about do it for all of my fishing and slash workshop materials here. Um, got any trips, any, yeah, any, any tips or tricks, uh, feel free to share them in the comment section below. And uh, thank you very much for watching my video.